LP carbon monoxide sensor change like and subscribe please this is the way I did it it may not be correct all the way I'm not an electrician I am a machinist I fixed everything in my life by myself I've repaired machines cars houses I doubt I'm not a professional and I'm not an expert by no means I learned how to fix stuff because that's the only way I could afford to do what I'm doing today thank you and it's hot I gotta turn the AC on <laughs> now it's time to open the package do I use her good sewing scissors how about a saw well we got these cool medical scissors here which uh, EMTs wear carry with them we were part of a cert team in Atchison Kansas we still have these they work real good I hate these blistering packages like everybody else in the world my thumb is stuck ow I have two toolboxes one outside one inside my inside toolbox is for quick repairs in the RV in the middle of the night when something goes wrong it was very handy at three o'clock in the morning to reach in this cabinet pull out some basic tools so I can fix something quickly and go back to bed without have to go outside and it's stored in our storage compartment in our new cabinets it says we have storage this is kind of like Mr. Mr. Whoopi's closet. Now I'm dating myself. Yay, wire nuts. And I only had to pull all that out this time. That's pretty easy. Hooray. Well, I looked at radar and you can see where it looks like we're gonna get something. And even more is popping up. Oh boy, yeah. It's starting to pop up. It's gonna pop and go. Um, hopefully I get this video done before if not I might just show you the end of it because I got to get this thing changed I have a few other projects to do today some are good videos some aren't I'm supposed to go on the roof and clean the air conditioner I don't think that's going to happen so we're going to prep this most of these come in with those crimp on wire deals and I don't have them I don't like them I've seen them fail. I hear everybody promise how great they are. I've seen them get clipped on and pulled apart. If you get moisture in them, they get wet. You can put a shrink wrap over top of it. I still don't like them. I'm a little old school. I like my wire nuts. I still like these and some tape. I could take it apart, repair it, Put it back together again real quickly preferred method old but it worked great for me here we go down here is our fuse box and we have to kill the power to this LP carbon dioxide sensor so best thing to do is I got this little tool here I'll show you and grab this and pull
pull it. Now I did pull it out last night because we were going to be gone for a couple hours and I didn't want it to go off with the dogs if it faulted out again. I put the fuse up on the counter. It disappeared. I don't know how that happens. So now it's clear to kill the power, the light went off, and this is the little tool that you use. Works really cool and handy. A must buy. Now that I am done with putting that guy in there, I have all this stuff to put away. Well, the fun part of living in an RV, put it all back where it came from in its little cubby hole. <laughs> 